The explosion site at Shama in the western region has since been cordoned off by the Environmental Protection Agency, EPA. The cause of the blast is still unknown. The owner of the quarry company is also still at large. We've put public notice out there that he should report himself to EPA. Indeed, I've asked my officers to make formal complaint to the police that we are looking for him uh, to assist in the investigations. Concerns have been raised regarding the EPA's monitoring role to prevent such incidents. And the executive director, Dr. Henry Kokofu, says they are retooling on that aspect. Uh, we have a robust monitoring system, but like any other um, institutional operations, uh, you may have uh, people recalcitrant who do things at the blind side of you. Uh, monitorings are done basically during the day and all that, hoping that uh, factories and uh, uh, facilities like a quarry uh, site will operate within the day. Internally, we put up three-man committee headed by a board member to look at how best uh, we can um, put our acts together, enhanced uh, uh, monitoring, compliance and enforcement uh, regimes. Dr. Henry Kokofu says the reassignment of the Western Regional Director of the EPA was coincidental. EPA has undergone some um, portfolio changes and um, the Regional Director is part of, uh, if you care to know, the Asante Regional Director is moving to Accra West, that is Summer Summer. Uh, somebody from Ahafanu is taking over at Asante. So it is no news if somebody is taking over uh, Western Region. Even at Public Service Commission, we've been instructed to ensure uh, some kind of realignment. Just as we are about taking place and all that, these things happen.